manufacturing made our region, and in some ways we're remaking manufacturing here today. In fact, manufacturing has been the most active sector in terms of business investment in our region for the past six out of eight years. According to the Pittsburgh Regional Alliance, manufacturing accounted for 68 announced projects and almost half a billion dollars in capital investment in 2014. And yes, that's billion with a B. The growth of the region's energy industry has been a big part of it, and there's no better example of how it's driving innovation than two local startups, Aquion Energy and Winstacks. Matt Maroon is Senior Director of Product Management with Aquion Energy. Ron Godovic is CEO of Winstax Wind Power Systems. Callum Monroe is Global Technical Director of Industrial Coatings with PPG Industries. And Bob Deathorn is Product Director, Industrial Food and Beverage Business Unit of Calgon Carbon. So thanks, great to have you all here. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna start, I think, and focus on our two startups. So Matt, let's start with you. Tell me a little bit about Aquion Energy. What do you guys do exactly? So Aquion Energy is a manufacturer of uh, low-cost, sustainable energy storage technologies, um, primarily geared at people that are, you know, have PV, solar on their roofs, um, that are setting up microgrids, and uh, the other people that are just off-grid. So you're talking energy storage, you're talking batteries? Energy storage, so yes, so <laughs> specifically batteries, that's correct. Okay, so what makes your battery better than all the other batteries that are out there around the world? We use uh, low-cost, um, sustainable, natural raw materials. Um, we've taken a lot of care in the manufacturing process, not to introduce anything that would be toxic. Um, everything we use is environmentally benign, from the chemistry to the manufacturing process, um, all the way to set up and installation at customer uh, sites. Yeah. yeah, well, I'm going to come back and talk a little bit about manufacturing something like this, which I understand you're doing out in Westmoreland County, which is uh, 50 miles or so from downtown Pittsburgh. But let's, let's first find out about Winstax, another company that's manufacturing wind power technologies here in Pittsburgh? Yes, we sure are. Uh, Winstax, we're based down on Smallman Street in the Strip District of Pittsburgh. and Only a few miles from where we are right now here at the Energy, Energy Innovation Center, right? Just, just a yeah. few miles away. Yes, it's, uh, it's a great place to be. and. Uh, and to start a business. We've been in Pittsburgh about two years and we manufacture a vertical axis wind turbine. So it's a, it's a turbine that stands vertically, uh, unlike a uh, windmill type. Being a vertical turbine, it takes a very small footprint and the nature of the rotor design is such that it can work in lower wind speeds and more turbulent wind. In fact, uh, we have one just a few blocks down the street on a rooftop from where we're sitting right now that powers a commercial building. And we have about uh, oh, a dozen or so just around southwestern PA. Not generally a great wind area, but perfect for our systems. And you're actually manufacturing the, this technology right here in Pittsburgh? We do, from the ground up. We have a 10,000 square foot facility with big cranes and uh, you know, we, we build them down here, we install them. And it's not really just the turbines, uh, as Matt has mentioned, uh, we, we really specialize in microgrids. So we not only capture the energy, but we store it and manage that energy for homes and businesses. So it's really a wind power system. It's not just the, the spinny thing, which is neat. Uh, it's really a uh, fairly sophisticated uh, green energy power management system. So just by happenstance, a little farther out, Smallman and Penn and in Lawrenceville, just beyond the Strip District, that's where Aquion kind of got its toehold after the university. But you're now manufacturing out in Westmoreland County in a great big facility with a lot of room for growth. What led to that and what, how's that uh, unfolding? So um, three or four years ago, um, we set up a manufacturing facility in Westmoreland County. We have 330,000 square feet out there. Um, we have a full, we have one manufacturing line. The facility's uh, size such that we could grow up to five manufacturing lines uh, all within the same building. And we are currently commercially producing and shipping batteries to customers around the world from that facility. That is crazy and uh, you know, exciting obviously for those of us here in Pittsburgh. Did you look around when you were trying to decide where to manufacture I, something like this? It, it actually makes a lot of sense to keep manufacturing close to where R&D and engineering and the rest of the company is. So it made, it made a lot of sense. Um, uh, you know, the building is an old building, old manufacturing building from both uh, Volkswagen and Sony. Uh, they had all the right sort of utilities set up for us. Uh, it just made sense to be close to the rest of the company. Now, how about you, Ron? I know you're a Pittsburgh guy. You've, what, done 11 startups, though. So uh, you've been around. Yeah, you've yeah, seen a lot of different <laughs> opportunities. Yet you chose to build this business here and, and manufacture here as well. What, 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 what made the case for that? We started 
quite from an idea. So we could have started the business anywhere. So we looked at places as far away as Wyoming, Colorado, Florida, Virginia, but we really kept coming back to Pittsburgh. And the one thing that those other places lacked was the, you know, that core of manufacturing skills and hands-on skills. You know, frankly, we could have put 50 engineers in a building out in Colorado, but we couldn't have found anyone to build them. So that's, we just kept coming back to Pittsburgh mainly for that. And uh, being in the strip district, it's a, we can, if we need to go see Aquion, they're five blocks away, we'll, we can walk. If uh, we need to see PPG Industries, which we do, we use their coatings, we can walk or jump on a bike. So just in that little area, there's a cluster of, of um, supporting firms that we use. So it's, it's a perfect place to be. Very cool, great to see it happening here. Mm -hmm. Well, coming up, from startups to a pair of innovative manufacturers who have called our region home for decades, reinventing themselves along the way. Stay with us.